Welcome back to another edition of Fly Tying for Beginners. Today we're going to tie a Pale Morning SOS. The hook that I have in the vise is a 2457. This is a scud hook. This is a size 18 from Green Caddis Outfitters, greencaddis.com. I'm going to use a cream thread. We're going to Start that thread behind the eye, and we're going to get rid of the excess. We're going to start out, I found out that putting the rib in first is a better idea than putting the tail on first. We're going to attach that right behind the bead, and we're going to bring that down slightly around the bend. For the tail, we're going to use a cream hackle. You want some nice stiff ones here. This is a mayfly. I like to have some nice stiff tail on the mayfly nymphs. We're going to make that about the length of the body, just about. Tie that in right where that rib is. And then we're going to bring that forward. Going to trim off the excess. I'm going to form a little bit of a taper on the body just by going back one time. Don't go all the way and then just come forward. Then I'm going to put some more wraps by the bead so it doesn't bounce around all now we're going to take the ta the rib and we're going to put a wrap underneath the tail first and that will kind of help stand that up a bit i'm going to go ahead and palmer this forward nice even spacing and you can bring that right up close to the bead and tie it off there. Go ahead and helicopter that wire off. I'm going to take some pearl crystal flash for the legs. I'm going to tie them in right at the front. They're going to be a little bit long and that's okay because we can just trim them down. Get control of these here. There we go. We want them to, to uh, stick out straight for the time. So we have some room to wrap our thorax. I'm going to trim them down just a bit. So I don't have that big long piece. I'm just going to push them forward. Now we're going to put it in the wing case and I have like a pale yellow floss. I have two wide pieces. They're not even. I'm just going to trim them up there to be even. And we'll tie them in. We're going to bring that thread back and the wing case back. We want to have about three to four wraps of rib exposed. I'm going to take some Pale Morning Crystal Dub. You don't need a lot. We're going to wrap that thorax. Now, when I have a little bit of dubbing left on there, I'm going to go in front of the legs, and that will help to push them back a little better. 
can see they're going we're gonna take back our now. Case. We're going to fold that over. We're going to give that a couple of maybe three tight turns there. Put a couple of turns in front of it. And we can trim down our wing case. And now we can cut the legs to length. And you want them just slightly past the thorax. We'll take our whip finish. Get a drop of head cement on there. You can just get it on the bead and let it roll in. And here we have a pale morning SOS. Hope that you learned something from this video. Hope you would subscribe to my channel. Please refer me to your friends. Leave comments, questions, suggestions, and most of all, thank you very much for watching my videos.